position of image. The image I is as far behind the mirror as the object O is in front of it. That is, the perpendicular distance of image from the mirror is equal to the perpendicular distance of object from the mirror. Let us prove it. Figure shows the formation of image of a point object O by a plane mirror M, M1. A ray OF incident normally on the mirror gets reflected by the mirror along the same path that is along FO. Since angle I is equal to 0 degree, therefore angle R also is equal to 0 degree. The other incident ray OA gets reflected along AC such that angle OAN is equal to angle NAC where AN is the normal drawn at the point A on mirror MM1. The reflected rays FO and AC meet at a point I when they are produced backwards. The point I is the virtual image of the object O. We are to prove that IF is equal to OF. For the incident ray OA reflected as AC, angle OAN is equal to angle of incidence I and angle CAN is equal to angle of reflection R. By the law of reflection, angle of incidence is equal to angle of reflection or angle OAN is equal to angle CAN. But angle OAN is equal to angle AOF because they are alternate angles. And angle CAN is equal to angle AIF because they are corresponding angles. Therefore, angle AOF is equal to angle AIF. Now let us consider the triangles AOF and AIF. Angle AOF is equal to angle AIF. Angle AFO is equal to angle AFI. Both of them are 90 degrees and FA is the common side. Therefore, the triangles AOF and AIF are congruent. Hence, we have proved that OF is equal to IF. Thus, the image is situated on the normal drawn from the object on the mirror and it is as far behind the mirror as the object is in front of it.